and welcome to my Twitch or YouTube, whatever this is called. We're gonna play some Age of Empires 2, and I hope you enjoy the content. I'm gonna be in the rank queue, uh, 3 versus 3, and 4 versus 4. And uh, I guess the civilization is gonna depend a little bit on the map. Uh, I am around, I don't even recall where I am. I am around uh, 100 and uh, 1,150. Uh, so far in the ranked, I have uh, three wins with 100%. Uh, I would say that I'm around 1,200. Elo, Elo, Elio, what's this called? Uh, and I've, I've been playing this game for about, I guess it's six months. I guess I got it in March or May. And I've been playing the campaign. Uh, and when I finished most of the campaigns, I started to go for um, the ranked. And then I got the, um, I got the DLC now at the Steam sale. So yeah, I'm pretty new at this game. But I guess I know some of the basics. Uh, the reason why I uh, installed the game, first of all, is because I really wanted to get... Um, I played this a lot as, uh, as a child, so that is the reason why I want to play, play it again. Uh, so yeah. This uh, competitive uh, gaming is kind of new for me. Uh, so we are in Arena, and I am most likely... Gonna think a little bit what I'm gonna try to do. Um, I'm gonna ask if it's. I'm gonna ask if it's okay if I'm pocket, and I'm probably gonna go for his downways. <clears throat> because I know that they're probably yes. gonna. You know, nice. Uh, I probably know that they're gonna go for. Um... Uh, cavalry these games normally they always do and they have my bombard cannons and I have my imperial camera riders it's gonna be pretty easy for me to play against uh, cavalry so yeah let's see how it goes I guess this is no problem for me how hard can it be so I guess I'm gonna just share my thoughts about how I think about the game. And uh, I'm not a pro. But I guess I know a little bit about the game. So of course you want to start with the scouting. It's really important. You want to send them to food ASAP. But then basically the game is kind of chill, because you're not really doing anything at the start. And I have to say that this is my first stream ever, so I have no idea <laughs> what I'm doing in this game, to be honest. I was trying to record it and uploading it to Switch, because it's much more easy on my internet. But I guess you cannot do that anymore on Twitch, which sucks. Uh, so yeah, most times on that arena, everybody's booming anyways, so it's not really gonna happen that much. I guess on this map, but you have to be a little bit active because sometimes they have a uh, rushing, like castle drops or something. I would say the castle drops is probably like the number one tactic that most players are going for these games, and you cannot really blame them because it is quite effective when you cannot retreat retreat in the back. Shikari. 
the reason, by the way, why I started to stream is because uh, there was some random player uh, following me on the uh, Ancient Vampire 2. I'm gonna have to drop force this. Oh, fuck. Uh, and he specifically asked me if I could uh, start streaming because he really enjoyed my content. And he thought that I was uh, doing a really good uh, atmosphere. So that is basically why I'm online right now. I didn't have any plans on doing it to be honest because... Uh, first of all, I don't really like my voice. <laughs> it sounds so strange when you record it. And also, um, it is a little bit weird, because I don't know if it's priority issues or what it is. That was a perfect tear cutting pulled. Mm. Because, you know, it's, it's one thing to play the game, but it's totally another thing to try to focus on the game at the same time that uh, you're talking. Wait. That is the wrong thing. Now get back in there, you little friend. Of course I got the only one that got hit by the board. That is so typical. <clears throat> and when you're playing this game, you should just always try to relax. Because when you're getting stressed, you're doing all of these weird mistakes. And I'm, I'm kind of new at this game as well. So uh, I'm doing mistakes all the time as you are probably about to see in this game. But you know, it's, it's at this CLO, you can do mistakes and it's forgiving, I, I guess. Tire, it's not really... You, you are gonna suffer a lot more at the higher CLO. Because if you play with good players, uh, for example Hera, that is pretty amazing. <laughs> Shout out to you. Uh, you, you are going to suffer pretty much if you do one mistake. It's not like you're gonna come back from a mistake. They are gonna abuse it so much that you're doing one mistake that it's most likely it's gonna cost you the game. And I, I have also uh, I have played one game against Hero, and uh, that was pretty insane. I was about to get a heart attack <laughs> because his micro even if you are doing everything right, he is so good with the micro management. So you are going to suffer. It's not even possible to get away from it. But uh, he, he has been playing the game for quite uh, a while as well, so it's not really that... It's not that weird that he's really good at it, you know. I would say that even though I've only played the game for about 5-6 uh, months competitive, yeah, maybe it's just me, but it feels like I'm doing a really good job, like I'm reading the game and what I should do. Uh, I'm not sure if there are common systems in the Twitch, but if it is, you know, you could you could let me know if I'm doing a good job or not. Because this Twitch channel is also, if somebody even watches this, and uh, if somebody watches this and uh, is good at this game, I mean, this is a thing for me as well to get better at the game, so... I mean, I hope, I think that this is a little bit of uh, the reason for me to get better myself at the game. Now I see I'm almost a second age, I know that he is not, so I'm probably gonna try to find Scout. Try to get some value of it. And I'm really gonna need some more food. Food, I mean. He probably won't hear. Now we have this, we have those. We do so, and so. Speed him up, fuck's sake. Yeah. Actually, we would probably have won the fight uh, since it was like one 30 seconds later than me. And actually, I'm not gonna talk that much in... Uh, it feels like I'm talking all the time, and I probably do, do. But I don't wanna talk too much, because I also want you to 
just watching the game and enjoy the content, not having me brag about how I did something good 20 seconds ago. <laughs> so this is probably what I'm doing mistake right now, I should go up. And I'm really trying, that is the horse I want to find. Come back, you son of a bitch. Ah, oh, that was probably a mistake as well, but it is what it is to know. I'm just gonna go up instead. Yep. I was missing the gold as well. Or actually I wasn't, but I, I missed it right now because I was going up. There we go. I'm probably gonna be a, a little bit late now. Even though I didn't do a lot of mistakes, but I got the loom way too soon, I think. And it's gonna cost me a little bit. Maybe I should just drop this one here as well. Mm, it's hard to read the game sometimes. I mean, Orange is already up. So I'm not sure if I'm doing a really bad job or he's really doing a good job. But I feel like I'm, I'm still in the game, you know? And I, I should probably have went up a little bit sooner, because even though he has a faster herd, herd the balls, I think it's 25% or something. Yeah, I should have went up a lot sooner. I have cheaper villagers than they have, so I should uh, be able to go up a lot sooner, since my villager is not really... Mmm, that could have been a really huge mistake. Namaste. Mm, I'm really gonna need to, need to go this game, so I'm gonna try to get their scout. Mm, I'm gonna need this one. I think we're just gonna do this, and we're gonna do this, yes, my bad, my bad. Chill out, mate, I see him. I guess I'm having a little bit of delay, I guess, I'm not sure if it's because of the stream. Mm, that was a bad placement. Mm. Gonna do this, we're gonna do this, top with this, so, zo, 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 zo. And now we're just gonna try to reduce as much uh, economy as we can. I mean, he's idle here, so I'm not really sure why you're making units. Just making them stand still. I gotta say though that we're all doing a really good job. Like this pathfinding, they were, they were staying up here and they still decide to go around the entire base. That is the frustrating thing. I think the most frustrating thing about this game is that, oh fucking hell, is that uh, it is the pathfinding is so bad sometimes that sometimes it feels like you're losing just because the pathfinding is not really your fault. Uh, somebody's attacked me, and I guess that it is a fucking scout. Uh, we, uh, we're gonna throw you. Yeah, this is gonna be nice. He's not gonna see that one coming. If he, if he realized that, he is gonna be the best fucking player I've ever seen. And he is dead, my friend. Nice. Very good job, Stefan. Very good job. Not very good job. You get housed again. For the 500th time, you get housed again. But it's not that hard. We're gonna get our passes. And we are. Doing pretty good. We're the best in our team at least. So it's something. Uh, I guess... The core issue for us right now is that we need to gather more relics. So we only have one... Uh, we only have one of these uh, guys. Not really sure what to call them. Priests out. I think that is a little bit problematic right now. If we if we want to get the, all of the relics, 
Sometimes you don't want to get him, and then it's just fine, I guess. Oh. Another good thing about this is, since I am um, Hindu Astanis, for every Asia go up, my villagers are getting cheaper. So that is pretty good for me, I guess. Yeah, so now I'm most likely gonna start going for gold. Because I know that my villagers are cheaper than uh, cheaper than uh, his is. His ours is who's I don't know. And I, I also have to say that my English is really bad. I think I was gonna say that. That uh, a little bit of uh, the part of this is just to learn uh, getting a little bit better English, for my own sake. Yeah, he has mainly dice. They are most likely gonna go for me, so this is gonna be a quite stressful game for me. But we do know this is probably gonna go hand cannoneers and he is gonna go manga dice. So it's ooh, that is gonna be so nice. See so if we, if we go for skirmishers skirmishers, skirts, skirms, I'm gonna say skirms because I think I actually need to say that one right. Mm, we are kind of gonna handle this, I guess. So we are going, my friend, to pop out. Nine, 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 nine. We are going to pop out archers. Like so. And that we can we 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 are really good sibling. Oh fuck. Wait. I mean I could go for one more teeth now, but since we know that they have army, they are going to be behind. So there is not really any use for us now to just mess out economy when we know that we're already in the lead. Um and I mean Red is doing really good. Even if he loses that one is oh fucking hell. Uh, this is problematic though. This is really problematic though. Because he is going to go for me really soon. Mm, nice. I mean, at least that's something. Oh, fuck, this is not good, mate. Not good at all. But we have really good echo, so we should probably be able to pull this bounce back. I don't really understand. I... Oh, this is nice. Oh, fuck, it's not. Yeah, maybe it's because of that. not nice. This is not nice at all. It's probably gonna cost me the game to be honest. At least we're gonna get this one. This is nice. Go in, go in, go in, go in. Yes, thank you. Oh, 
Thank you, Purple. You are saving my life. I am going to have to suck your dick for that. I mean, maybe I could have uh, handled that one alone. But I think the core issue right there was that this was so stressful on me. So it re if, uh, it's really hard to micromanage that one. But now I'm back on my feet and then I'm gonna go for three. Because th those units are really expensive. And he's gonna lose every one of them. So my focus right now is just getting back in the game. Trying to push back as much as I can. Uh, which I hope that I can. So I'm probably gonna get a siege. Because I know right now that he doesn't have a lot of... Um, Yeah, and now when I know he's on that one, I am most likely going to switch to cavalry. Maybe I should not get that one though. That would do so. And then we should just try to get wood, I guess. I mean, you could argue that the reason why I'm back in this game is mostly because of uh, this guy. I think since I'm a Hindustanis, I can get Hussars, I guess. Yes, that is really nice. Because I think that that is what's uh, gonna save me this game, because Hussars is really good for most of the stuff that I need right now. And I should probably watch my units a bit. I'm a can you just please leave me alone? Is it really that hard? I'm gonna go behind there and try to do something. For some reason it's really aggressive on me, and I guess it's not totally bad for me. I mean he is pretty aggressive and that is gonna cost him the game I think. I really hope at least. So. I'm 
I'm not sure if you guys know this, but uh, perks are really good at uh, arena. I would I would probably argue to say that they're one of the best uh, civilizations on this map. Uh, and you can probably see that one as well, so I don't really have to explain that, I guess. It's quite problematic, quite problematic, but this is the thing, you have to just keep calm right now. Because if you start to overreact, just sending all the units to them, just try to do something, you are gonna lose all of them. That is gonna be a, an even uh, big mistake. I guess we can do a little bit of those as well. Come on, please. Please, 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 please. Yes, thank you. Yeah, and it's gonna be dead now. I'm just gonna go behind there and kill him now. Because you see here now how many of these I have. I'm gonna get him over on. So problematic though. She probably got a lot more swarms as well. So I have to say though that he's doing a really good job. a little bit with the knights. Well played everyone. It, it was a really good game though. But if, if we watch, even though I have 73 now, right now, it feels like I lost everything. I mean, Tarek is basically at the same villager count than I am right now. So it's it's not always uh, lost just because you feel like you have lost the game. And he only had like 10 cannoneers. And if I kill those, you would have no... Uh, I'm not really sure what this is not working right now. Then it would have no... Um, come on, for fuck's sake. You would have no nothing to replenish, and I would get the bombardiers and the bom uh, bomber cannons. Is uh, I think 225 wood and gold. So he's almost 500 resources. And he's gonna put you really far behind. Um, But that is the thing, when when I saw him uh, going for um, the forward buildings, I knew right there that I cannot start doing more villagers because then I'm just gonna get outrun. And I know that it probably has a, a really bad economy. So then it's just try to get as much... What the hell is this? Then it's just everything there is just about getting as much um, units out as possible. He has to try to get him all around because you know that you have better economy than him. So yeah, that is basically what you do. I'm gonna just take a uh, short break, get some water, uh, and I'm gonna go back to the stream.
So I see you in uh, about 30 seconds.